in monitoring the suspected adverse drug reactions that have been shared into the WHO Global Database VigiBase on COVID-19 drugs. We have been producing a report summarizing these ADRs, which in turn have been shared with the WHO member countries as well as on a global basis. In parallel, we are preparing for the future monitoring on COVID-19 vaccines. From a research perspective, we wanted to add to the already existing knowledge database of COVID-19 with data analysis that UMC is in a unique position to produce. One of those things was a paper that was recently published in Drug Safety on the ADR reporting in COVID-19 use versus the non-COVID-19 use with a specific focus on six differences. We know from previous studies that COVID-19 seems to affect males and females differently and that males seems to have a more severe disease course. We also know that females seem to encounter but also report more adverse drug reactions than males. We therefore wanted to investigate if we could see this when it comes to the drugs being used in COVID-19 comparing to the non-COVID-19 use with a focus on the six differences. And as expected, we did see some differences between the sexes and that males, for example, seems to report more severe or serious adverse drug reactions than females. It is our area of expertise to fully appreciate the complexity arising from the COVID-19 treatments, including polypharmacy and drug interactions. Many of the drugs that were initially used for COVID-19 were actually repurposed. We knew about their clinical efficacy and safety of their approved indications, knowledge that has been crucial when monitoring the safety aspects when these drugs are being used in a totally new disease.